charge there. Save some teammates. But yeah, when you know that these melee guys are going to run in, you can throw the minefield right there and they'll just walk through and take a ton of damage. get knocked up there. I'm going to run for my life. He's going to die in a second. I think I might have flash here. Nope. So they actually take two turrets first. Then we're really going to have to end an inhib. So we're going to have to work hard to get back here, but we're 8, 2, and 16. Zed isn't feeding as much anymore. And we'll probably do in a standard build here. So we actually went Rabidons, half of Leandries, um, bits and pieces of Ludens. See, like... Why did you get that close to a dead Scion? You didn't need to take like any of that damage. And Zed runs right into that snowball. Good thing we could dump so much damage on him. And then Trindamir, who I hate, can just keep going after he's dead. There's my flash. Good satchel there. Put down some damage with the ulti. But he did. That Garen is dead. 11, 2, and 17 now. I wonder why I picked up part of Ludens there. Maybe because they're so tanky. Usually it would have finished the, uh, I mean, uh, Leandries. I usually would have finished Ludens rather than going for Leandries. I don't know what that little stutter was there for me. I just kind of stopped moving. I don't know why he went for Zed instead of me there. Does not seem like the right choice. He walks through my whole minefield, loses about 40% of his health from the minefield. And Ziggs just backs up. We still haven't taken our first tower, but we are going to take it here. I get killed, but I did take the tower with my satchel charge. There's a pretty good rocket jump there from Trist. Bet she wishes she had her alt. She's at rocket jumping pretty well, being mobile. It's about as good as she could have done. 12, 3, and 20. And we do finish Ludens. So we get Ludens, Leandries, and Rabidons. So we got all our key items right here. We're able to do a ton of damage to them. That ult did a lot to Gangplank. So from a shaky start, uh, Zed definitely came back um, pretty well. He 
and ready as we're coming on. All right, Hibs respawning. So it's super poke versus super tank, pretty much. And why would you go in on the, the dead scion? There's no point to that. You just run away. It's like when Trindomir is in his ult and is unkillable, you run away. You don't screw around and try to fight him because he's not going to die. So those Qs are doing a decent amount of damage at this point. Mm. Good flash. Still being pursued like crazy. Good satchel. No help from Brand. Wow. Yeah, Brand probably could have stunned them. But no, he just ran away. 14, 4, and 24. Let's see what we build next. There's a good ulti there. By Amumu. So next, I bet you we're building Void Staff. We've got the two parts of it. Yeah, having two uh, characters on your team that can basically come back from the dead is rough. So they got Scion and Trindomir. I think there's a... Oh, a Nivea can also. So imagine having those three people on the team. Good ulti. Brand's definitely doing some good damage. That was good. So Triss played pretty good, looking back now. Um, definitely used a rocket jump really well for mobility. So it just seems like she, she wants me to take tower hits. Nope. She managed that pretty well. Nice, good ulti there, Trist. Mm -mm. Tris is just running away. If I had flash, I'd be flashing right now, but I don't. 15, 5, and 33. That was a good little move to get out of the way there by a Mumu. All right, we finished Void Staff, so we're super powerful right now. Kind of walked right into that. Another good ulti from uh, Mumu. Not a bad ulti for me. Trist. 
Trace is just gonna run. So we got 594 AP right here. And those cues are definitely hurting people now. Yep, had to use the flash prefer to have not used it there um, but my Garen was thirsty for me my Garen wanted me bad see that would have been a great place to have my flash I think I am gonna die yep I got my ulti off but got caught in the gangplant ulti there so we start building lich bane at this point I think the sign's gonna mess up the team a little bit here yeah, you don't don't stand toe to toe with them. So yeah, we built part of Lichbane. Obviously, Trish does not have her alt there, and they just was my ulti there from across the map. And Zed last hit that instead of me. It's like, bro, why aren't you taking it? And the fear got the kill though. 18, 7, and 36, and they're going to take our inhib again. We're going to come back strong and get them. And we do finish the Lich Bane. There goes that Trendomir, Undying. So we got a 12 and 11 on the team, a 9 and 17. That Zed really did kind of feed. And Trist is 22 and 8 right now. I think after the game, I did have, uh, Ziggs did have a huge amount of um, damage, most damage on the team. So that was kind of rough there. He uh, Zonyazed when he saw my ulti coming in. That's too bad. Got him. Got him also. And let's just finish this off. He does manage to kill me off there, but I think the minions, oh uh, yeah, we're gonna just go finish this off. So we finished 21, eight and 39. Pretty solid, pretty, eh, I don't know if I want to say it's a clean win, but uh, it was a little bit back and forth. We definitely had a lot more kills than them. 
All right, so that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, please do um, like and subscribe here on YouTube and check me out on Twitch, Spinning Mantis, twitch.tv. That's going to be all for now. Spinning Mantis, out. <laughs>